Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Battalion Wars. This is Mission Beachhead. Our focus on operation now shifts to the Dune Sea. The civilian air fleet is moving in mass to control the nearer site fields inland, and our outposts on Fort Omaha will bear the brunt of the invasion spearhead. Reinforce them and repel the invaders. Okay, let's uh, see what this mission is. Mission accomplished, Kaiser Vlad. We have swift destruction upon both our enemies. Excellent news, Countess Ingrid. Proceed to the narrow side fields of the Dune Sea as planned. As you wish, Herr Kaiser. For too long, Exylvania has been the playground of frontier warmongers and tundra despots. At last, we will resume our rightful place in history as masters of these inferior nations. And when you are Emperor, Herr Kaiser? Yes, evil. I will make you governator. Now go, rally the troops. We strike again before dawn. Wow, that guy. Seriously creepy. But, looks like we got uh, a new enemy to battle with. I don't know what to expect from these guys. These seem like a... Maybe like an Austrian or German type nation i don't know i don't know who they're who they're trying to be welcome to the dune sea commander this is the world's number one repository at near a site is that like some the enemy's infernal war machine. oh there there he just explained what near a site was <laughs> the exylvanians have been attacking up and down the coast in an attempt to gain a foothold for the big push inland and I guess we gotta stop them. So far, but it's only a matter of time before they succeed in capturing one of our faces. Intel suggests that Fort Omaha here is on the hit list, so I expect you to defend it at all costs. Okay, well, I guess we will do just that, uh, General Herman. Heads up, hey, got our favorite vehicle, the heavy recon. Nice. With increased armor and firepower, it's a step up from the light recon. No, I, maybe this is the first time we've used it. Anyways, this is um an interesting battle. I actually have been playing uh this battle a couple times, so it's not completely new to me. I was rehearsing it a little bit, trying to figure out the best strategy. I kind of figure maybe I should rehearse the battles before I go blind into them because this to help me do a little bit better in the recordings. So I kind of found a strategy that kind of helps me. I kind of just put all my units inside of this little base and then go around and shoot all the enemies with the the heavy recon unit. I don't know if that's a very good strategy at all, but. Uh, We'll see how it turns out. I think the best score I've ever gotten is like A rank with it. I have a second save file that I've been practicing on, so I might turn down the volume of this. Just a bit. I don't know if the, uh, the, the action is too loud. Okay, it looks like we cleared all the uh, invading forces so far. We've got some more coming up, though. These guys are a lot tougher than the uh, Tundrans, that's for sure, though. And they have acid gas um, sprayers, which is uh, kind of scary. I would not want to face that in real life. And they can do some d considerable damage to uh, your heavy re recon, too. One of my units just died. Dang. Normally I do a better job of uh, protecting the base, but I guess when I'm commentating, it's a little bit more tricky to pay attention to what's going on. Put one guy in that bunker. They don't really do all that well if they're in the bunkers, though, unfortunately. 
tilting up and down on the sea stick. I don't want all my units to follow me. Dang it. I didn't mean for that. I just wanted about one guy to go in there. I forgot to go into control individual units. Let's go set these guys back into the base here. If I can get in. I swear the these uh, tires don't get any traction in these on this road. Oh shoot! I'm a, oh my gosh! I'm not a good driver, as you can see. Heavy recon, light recon, they're all control about the same. It's slippery. It's almost like they're always driving on ice. All right, hopefully my artillery will shell all these guys. It's kind of hard to hit them if they're not stationary, though. Artillery's not very good at hitting moving targets, especially ones at this size. You'd think it would be, but... They don't um, lead the enemy, so they just shoot where the enemies are, and they don't shoot where they're going to be. So, artillery is not really, uh, good. Alright, there's that guy going in my base there. Kill him. Come on, get him, get him, get him. Don't let him live. on control one of these guys. Sometimes you have to just take full-on control of the small units. But I've noticed another attempts of trying this mission that if I'm not controlling my my heavy uh, recon it just dies pretty quickly so oh my gosh it's uh, like a whole truckload of them I don't even know what I'm doing I have the wrong unit <laughs> oh gosh jeez don't let them capture it what are you guys doing? My recon needs some health, though. My guy should have it pretty well covered. I don't think there's any more in here. All right, get them all back in here. Oh, light tanks! I forget about these guys sometimes. Control, get my uh, bazookas to fire on them. Come on, shoot, 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 shoot. Get it. I don't know about that. I think we're getting our butts equally kicked. Although we're not doing too bad right now. I only lost two units so far. I think we started with 10 infantry. Riflemen. So, hopefully we can maintain that. That lady is still creepy looking. And the little picture she has in the corner of her uh, narration or her commentary is freaky. Okay, we should get uh, some anti-air unit and some more infantry and that should be helpful. Yeah. Now we're cooking with grease. This is the first time in this game we get to use the anti-air. So... Let's make good use of it, I guess. There are going to be some bombers coming through. If I remember. This thing is a lot better than the missiles at times. I actually kind of prefer just using missile bats. Let's see if I can kill that thing before it actually drops the troops. Oh, I did. Nice. A lot of times I'm not even able to shoot, aim at, or get a lock on that thing before it uh, <laughs> lands and drops off like a whole wave of uh, units in my base. Lost an artillery, but they weren't really helping all that much anyway. It's just going to hurt our technique, that's all. 
these little rifle, these little infantry units move so quickly that the um, artillery don't do much. Except for against those tanks, that's the only time that our artillery was useful. Uh, gotta change to these anti-air because there's those bombers coming in. And these guys will definitely mess up your units if you let them uh, <laughs> if you let them bomb too long. Come on, take it down. Nice. I'm trying to lock on, but it's just not. I can't even aim that high. So that's kind of the way the controls are. Let's see, now I can aim a little higher. I think there's one more bomber out there. There it is. Can I get it? Nice. I think this mission would have been a lot easier with some, miss with some missile vets. Until he has claimed the June Sea in the name of the Kaiser. Those Exylvanians sure are. That guy's creepy. Do you think it's something to do with this desert climate? I don't know. <laughs> Let's see how we did, though. Hopefully, we did better than we normally do. A rank is better. Technique was what we failed. 5% more on technique, we would have gotten S rank. Oh well. We got an A, so I'll take it. It's better than what I normally get on these videos. All right, well, if you liked the video, hit the like button. If you have something to say, leave a comment. This has been The Gaming Casual, and I'll see you in the next episode. Have a great day.